Today is Food for Thought comes from the fifth chapter of Lamentations, verses 15 and 16, and verse 21, which reads, The joy of our heart has ceased. Our dance has turned into mourning. The crown has fallen from our head. Woe to us, for we have sinned. Turn us back to you, O Lord, and we will be restored. Renew our days as of old. Jeremiah, he was full of lament after the fall of Jerusalem. And we see that lament here in and throughout the book of Lamentations. Now, after the fall of Jerusalem, some of the Jews, they ended up living in exile in Babylon, while others, they lived in exile in Egypt. Jeremiah was one of those that lived in Egypt. The Jews, including Jeremiah here, we see that they were suffering. They were suffering because they remembered the days of old. You see, they had great joy in the days of old when they weren't living in a foreign land under the thumb of another. And so while they were living in that foreign land, especially in Babylon, many, they lost their joy. Now we know that life is not always sunshine and rainbows. There are always gonna be times where we have our afflictions, where we have our tribulations, and there are gonna be times where our afflictions and our tribulations are great. In those times, you may even feel like your soul has been shattered. You may feel like your soul has been broken into pieces. I would say that in those days, your soul is in need of a revival. So how do we go about reviving our soul? How do we go about uplifting our soul? Well, here, when we take a look at Jeremiah's prayer, we see that in his supplication, Jeremiah, he acknowledged that his joy had ceased. He acknowledged that his people and him himself that they had sinned, Jeremiah, he then asked for God to turn them back to him, to restore their souls as days of old. When your soul is in need of reviving, I say to you today, go to God and acknowledge the condition of your soul. You see, the Lord, he doesn't want you to toil in despair. God, he will restore your soul, not to the days as of old, but to even better days. God, he will always push you forward. He won't push you backwards. He will lift your soul up for the better.